Yo, what is up, guys? It's Mike Sturzum. Welcome back to the channel. And today, we are playing some Resident Evil 2. It is the 25th. This game has just dropped. I pre-ordered it yesterday. I got all the good stuff. So I got the deluxe version. So we got all the pre-order bonuses and all the deluxe stuff. So, uh, yeah. Let's get right into it. Does it say Resident Evil 2? Well, damn. Alright, so here we can select either Leon or Claire Redfield. So, um, obviously, I played Resident Evil 4 before, so I'm going to play as Leon, honestly, Mr. Kennedy, right? And let me just say before we start this, I'm, I really can't deal with scary games. Um, Resident Evil itself wasn't really meant to be scary, but it's, it kind of scared me every now and then. Uh, so this is really gonna get me. <laughs> oh goodness. Um, yeah, we're let's let's go right in with Leon. Uh, assisted aim assist recovers certain amount of health. Enemies are a little weaker. Nah, hardcore. Uh, saving requires an ink ribbon. No auto save. Stronger enemies. I'm not gonna go hardcore. I did hear about it before where you need ink ribbons to save, and, and that's just. That's just extra. I don't need that. Uh, so we're just going to go normal. We have auto save and all that good stuff. So let's go standard. I, pr I might play hardcore in the future, but I might not record it. I don't know. Let's see. All I know is I'm going to record as Leon and I'm going to record as... What's her face? Look, man, I'm serious, okay? I saw this with my own eyes. Oh, I believe you, buddy. I believe you. <laughs> just tell us a story. Tell us a story. That looked nasty. That looked like a face or something. Um, um, why they gotta show his mouth so close, though? Okay, tell us, be honest now. How many drinks did you have? No, man, I barely had a buzz on. Oh, come on. Look, just listen, all right? She got closer, and I got a good look at her. You gotta see her eyes, her nose. Obviously, this guy's gonna run into one. They get a real person and get bit. It's so like my wife. obvious, but okay. Something's happening. Just getting good. By the way, guys, this is very loud. I don't know if you guys hear it this loud, but. Uh, I do have a weird voice, and you probably already noticed by now, I'm kind of a little sick. There you go. And then he's like, oh no, I hit a person, and he dies. He's like, are you okay? No, duh. Like, it's so obvious, especially when you see a truck driver, like, what else is gonna freaking happen? Well, if he sees her face, he'll probably notice something is wrong, right? No, nope, he still thinks it's a no- Especially after what he just heard. Like, he would have seen the face and been like, Hmm, something's wrong here. Oh, <laughs> of course. She actually, like, has, like, a- Her complexion looked very good. Probably it was just that half of her face, but I don't know. Then it could, it could be one of those things kind of like, um, The Walking Dead where, uh, where they said that everyone's already infected. Once they die, they already become a zombie because they're all infected anywhere. Could be that. Who knows? <clears throat> Mr. Kennedy. Yeah, I, I've seen this a couple times and I'm just like, how... Is, did Leon go from this to how he looks on the fourth one? He doesn't look anything like him. There's no resemblance. That's weird. Oh, says it's open. And he's like, wait, why is no one here? Oh, blood. Blood, blood, blood. And of course, this is where he finds out there's an outbreak. 
This kind of reminds me of, um, of, um, uh, the guy from The Walking Dead. Honestly, guys, I'm going to say this. I already started playing this, but, um, the audio cut out. So this first episode, I already played it. I'll probably still get scared, though. <laughs> But what, the guy with the truck, come on. Obviously, it was going to happen. But um, let's go. This guy, I, I, again, I just don't know how he turns into Leon from Resident Evil 4. Okay, let's just walk. Oh, we can run by clicking this. Hello? Anybody there? Yeah, that's why he has the sheriff costume on. Because usually he has the other costume. Something's not right. That's why it's funny because it reminded me of The Walking Dead because he was in a sheriff costume. We got some chips and dips. Chips and dips, please. Chips and dips. Right? Oh, this guy. <laughs> Does he look all right? Okay. Chips and, dips. chips and dips. Chips and dips. Chips. Chips. Chips and dips. Chips and dips, uh, chips and dips, and chips and dips, chips, chips, no, chips and dips, no, okay, whatever, uh, let's go into here, uh, seems normal, just a normal freezer, and the freezer, yeah, did in that indeed close behind me, <laughs> You got this, man. You got this. The way they just like, pulls that piece of skin is just like hanging on his. I'll shoot. What the? So I kind of like what they did here, where like when you aim, as you aim longer, it starts to like go exactly where you need it to go. It starts to like um, what do you call it? Aim better. I love how we start with only like uh, what was that like, ten bullets, and literally have no more. Um, yeah, okay. I, I mean, I remember in Resident Evil Four, you can like take your knife out and. and it's, it's, do that while he was on the floor. Um, yeah. But, uh, let's go over here. Oh, we got the keys and, um, wow. Okay, wait, uh, this is PG-13, guys. This is, uh, wait, what? <laughs> Escape the storeroom. Yep. Look at him no there. Way. This can't be. God damn it. What the fuck? Uh, is he dead yet? <laughs> That's a good question. Uh, next. Okay, let's take the key, use it. <clears throat> oh goodness, this place is full of them now. I remember the first time I started dying, like, right away. I was, like, getting bit left and right. Oh goodness. Oh. Clear. What a lie. I just wasted, like, three headshots on him. And now you're just gonna come and just headshot him? You all right? Yeah, I think Once. So. Thanks. But you can thank me later when we're safe. Holy shit. Look, man. I ain't got that much ammo. Come on. Ooh. Get in. Damn, okay. Hold on. Is 
So like I said, first episode reaction, I kind of failed because I had the headset plugged into here, so you couldn't hear any of the audio. So like, yeah. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah. It's so retarded. Like, okay, he's in a sheriff costume. He's in a cop car, but oh wait, you're a cop? No. Whoa. Looking for my brother. He's a cop too. Good thing we found each other. I don't know what to expect anymore. Maybe it was the guy back there. It was her brother. Welcome to Raccoon City. Wasn't that sign all the way back there? Whatever. Alright. Resident Evil 2. <clears throat> Let's do this. Okay. Attention, all citizens. Due to a citywide city outbreak. outbreak, you were advised to take shelter at the Raccoon <coughs> City Police Station. In the police station. Not like uh, anything's gonna go down at the police station. God, this is so unreal. Police station's not much farther. They'll know something. Yeah, but what if we're the only ones? What if there's no survivors? No, there's survivors. It's a big city. There has to be. Hmm. Well, damn. Guess we're gonna have to walk from here. Looks like we're walking from here. Yeah, I, I already know what he says. More like running. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, More like running. Yeah, good call. That scared me the first time too. Goodness. Is he even try? Oh, and that is the truck from earlier. Holy shit! There, get out! Get out now! Claire, get the hell out of my car! Fuck! Oh, damn! Ooh! Ooh! He hit it! He's up! What am I doing? Why am I replicating what's happening? Okay. Well, there goes all his gas. I'm trying to say exactly what I said last time. And, and there goes his car. That's gotta hurt. That has really gotta hurt. <clears throat> For a second, I was like, oh, she did. Can't stay here, it's not safe. Go on ahead. I'll meet you at the station. I'll be there. This is out of control. So, one thing I already noticed playing this uh, the first time around is unlike uh, Resident Evil 4, where you go killing every single, uh, every single zombie. Here you kind of want to avoid some Shit. zombies. It's everybody. I love again, same as the first time I said it. I love how he used that terminology. They've all turned. There it is, the station. Oh, 
wrong way. I was like, please just open. I was like, if it needs a key, I was like, no. It's horrible. Alright. Yeah, now how's Claire gonna get in later? You know? She's not. That's how. Alright. What if they're, like, smart enough to, like, put their hand in and go... <laughs> you scum. You're scum. Alright, um... I know there's nothing out here. So let's go in the station. Da -da -da. Explain your surroundings. Okay. Hello? I know there's a first aid spirit anybody... here. Thank you. Uh -huh. Here? This is maximum standard handgun. When I first saw it, I thought it was um what do you call it? Magnum um bullets oh what, what's it called yeah magnum yeah whatever i love how it shows it has like two four six eight ten twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen uh fifteen shots in there when you look at it it only has six <laughs> oh yeah and then okay uh, as you take damage your health monitor will be fine caution danger blah 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 oh okay so it says to find to caution to danger all right Key, this is a well worn key. That's the key to, uh, um, what, where, where's that? So we can examine keys and stuff. So, like, if you see here, it says Mosoil, uh, storage room, which was that back place we were at. The key to the gas station storage room. Yeah, so let's watch this real quick. RPD, that's Raccoon Police Department, Raccoon City. There must be someone here. There must be someone. Not good. David, Marvin, you there? I found a way out. It's in here. And there he goes. Oh. Or not. East hallway. East hallway. Oh. Shows it there. Yeah, I was wondering where the hell it was last time. Alright, so we need to find this guy. And right here we have a vault, and right here we have our typewriter. So we got these deluxe weapons. I'm gonna take this one, take the, take it out. Yeah, take it out. Okay, oh it looks very nice. It holds 15 shots, still a nine millimeter. With a hard steel slider and a silver glider trigger for increased accuracy and ease of use. Okay, so we're gonna take this and we can't store it. It still has three bullets inside. So, yeah. Fudge. That sucks. But, um, we're gonna use those three and then we're gonna come back. I guess. Okay, so do that. Okay. Right, so let's do this. Load it. Beautiful. Right, and then we're, we're, so we're gonna use these three. And then, um, once we do that, we're gonna use these. Yeah, but, and then I'm gonna store this, because I don't need it. I wonder how much this can store. Can it store more than, what is that, like five, six? Whatever, um, <clears throat> let's, let's save this. We're around the 20 minute mark. I kind of want to keep this series a little shorter. Um, I don't want to. I don't know. I don't want to drag out the videos to uh, 20 minutes anymore. But I do notice. I noticed this in the end of my last video that I finished, and I, then I restarted it because I noticed that the audio didn't get in. But um, I want to see what the hell this does. Oh. Um, I know there's another one here, but we need something to get it. 
Hmm. Yeah, we need probably like a knife or something to just like pry it open. Alright. Oh, we got a door here. We're trying to go to the east side though. And then we have this, which looks like it's gonna have like three little things and then it's gonna open some grand place or something. I don't know. We'll see. I haven't been up here, so I don't know what the hell. From here on out, it's it's all unknown. Let's see what's this. Oh, we have a little uh, puzzle here to solve. Right off the bat. Though we don't really need it yet. Uh, most likely farther into the story, we'll get the, uh, the key to this. Uh, also, in the first video, I had a clip where I was showing putting all the brightness and stuff. Because it asked you to do that. Oh, very nice. <laughs> Thank you. Let's take this one and we'll reload that. There you go. Okay. Um, yeah, there's nothing else over here. Yeah, so I might add that on. Though, I'm not sure if I had any background music for the game. But I might add that on to the beginning. Um, but this is the gameplay, I mean. <laughs> Alright. Hopefully there's some more ammo over here. So I can have a good amount of ammo. Another door here. No, no ammo. Well, well damn, you cheap bastard. <clears throat> you cheap bastard. You only give me one ammo. Thingy. Okay, so if you hit triangle, uh, here we got the map. Making use of the map. The map screen is useful. And then adjust your current location and surroundings. It shows you X, Y, Z. Okay. So, um, we're in the main hall right now. On the upstairs. It shows that, which is the line statue. Let's go downstairs. So, let's check this again. We got downstairs, which which it has the goddess statue, the tape box, which we need to uh, open somehow. Uh, there's this uh, entrance place, and there's this entrance place. Uh, I don't think that's an entrance place. This is the only one here, so we're going to have to go. The only way to get there, I don't know. So, uh, this is the entrance. How do we open it then? That's my question. Because if... Okay, right. So that's the entrance right there, but it says keep out, but how do I get in? Oh, I'm going to pull it up, or I'm going to climb in, crawl in. Oh, goodness. I don't like this. Um, this is first reaction. This is first reaction. Okay. All right. All good? Okay. Uh, let's exit. Uh, press room, east, office. Uh, what's this? Okay, I guess once we get that second fuse there, uh, we can open this fully and we don't have to crawl under it. Oh! Oh, crap. Okay, so we need to find the second thing to get back. I hope this auto saves while we're in here because if not, I can't save it again. Okay, let's see where I have to go. Okay, so I can go into this office here if I want. I don't know if it's open or not. Uh, looks like there's something on here. At least it shows something on the map. No, it was back there. That was the fuse box. Okay. Okay, and then there's the office. Can we open it? Nope. Okay. That's what I thought. Expected. That scared the crap out of me. Is there something in here? No. Can we like open it and look for supplies? Alright. No. Naughty. You got this. Do I know? <laughs> Do I know? 
All right. Uh, I don't. I don't like this door here. I don't like this door. <laughs> I keep referring back to this place. So we have to get uh, to this hallway here to the watchman's room. I think we gotta get to the watchman's room. I don't like this door here. I feel like as I walk past it, something's gonna. Okay. Did you just hear that? Oh goodness, I don't like this. Okay, so there's a little hallway here. I don't know if there's anything there. What's this? Is there something I can do here? Hydrant. Another hallway thing. <coughs> Is that some coffee? I need some coffee. Jesus. For real. Uh, okay, yeah. Another lock place. Open up! Hurry! Open up! Open this goddamn door! I'll get you out! Oh, come on. Please! Give me your hand. Help me! I got you. Boy dead. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, that's it. He's gonna come back to life on him. Oh. <laughs> He said whatever we, they needed was in that box. Okay, so the goddess statue brings you. Okay, so it goes down to a, a basement. And then it goes down. Something's down there. The parking. And then there's a way out. Alright. Cool. Um, okay, so it shows me the answer. To these things, I'm confused. All right, flip pages. Okay, so these are the two pages we got. All right. Uh, we kind of need the fuse. Oh goodness. May I ask, how am I supposed to get out of here? Oh, I found a first aid spray. Nothing here. I don't know if they could find me in the bathroom. <laughs> Bunch of toilet paper. Yeah, okay. Caution. Okay, so there's this place. What's this? Oh, some handgun ammo. Son of a bitch! God damn it! Danger. Got him. God damn it. Gotty. Gotty. Alright, uh, I'm gonna use this first hate spray. Cause I'm about to die. Alright. Uh, can I find the fuse or something here? That's what I need. 
What was this for? Oh, the light. Okay. I need to find the fuse. It isn't. Is it in here? Okay, the bathroom's open. The watch place is open. Um. Okay, there's another room here. Maybe I could find it in there. Um. <clears throat> Because I needed to get back and save the game. Oh, goodness. Son of a bitch. I don't believe that he's down, but... Oh, wooden boards, okay. I know uh, you can put that on windows, I guess. And what's this? More handgun ammo. But I need a way to get out of here. I don't have it. And it closed behind me. Oh, it did it. I can go back. Oh, who helps me? God. Ooh, damn. You're safe. For now. Thanks. Marvin Brown. Leon Kennedy. Um, there was another off I couldn't, I couldn't. Here. I'm sure you did what you could, Leon. Um. Does anyone know what started this? Mm. Honestly, all you need to know is that this place will eat you alive if you aren't careful. Yeah, well, I was supposed to start last week, and I got a call to stay away. I wish I'd come here sooner. You're here now, Leon. That's all that matters. Okay, Lieutenant. I'm ready. Hopefully, you'll be able to find a way out of this station. That officer you met earlier, Ellie. He thought this secret passageway might do the trick. <clears throat> This is good news. And now it's full of blood. We can get you to a hospital. No, no, I am not the priority for you. Lieutenant, I'm not just gonna leave you here. I'm giving you an order, rookie. You save yourself first. I'd come with you, but I just slow you down. Now, you'll need this. I can't take it. Stop. Oh, the knife. And don't make my mistake. If you see one of those things. Uniform or not, you do not hesitate. You take it out, or you run. Got, Got it. it? Yes, sir. <laughs> he gonna be the first one we gonna have to kill. Combat knife. Equip into your inventory screen to use. This knife wears down with use and will break when this scotch is depleted. R1 is ready. R2 to slash. Can be used to counter attack while you are caught by an enemy. And can only be retrieved once you defeated one. Alright, so that's pretty cool. Okay, what's this? A combat knife. Didn't we just get that? All right, got it. Are we gonna try to kill him? All right. Oh, this went a little too long. I just wanted to go in there real quick and and just like uh, do that. But this it's going on thirty six minutes now. Uh, I always make this mistake, but you know what, guys? <laughs> Subscribe and uh, hit that uh, notification icon goodness if if you did enjoy the video do like down below so i will get some more content i'll do it anyway but 
it, it would be appreciated. And uh, let me just go into this typewriter real quick. Go like this. Go like that. And I mm, mm, comment down below any guy, games you guys like to see. And I guess I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.